is an introduction to mathematical induction. We'll show an example for the principle of math induction. And so in a sentence or two, we'll show what it is. The principle of math induction is to show or prove a sequence is equal to an expression given for every positive number n starting with 1, or to any number higher than 1, which is that being n plus 1. Math induction is not necessarily to prove that it's equal to. Uh, math induction can also be proved to prove inequalities of greater than or less than or equal to's. Or it could be one specific indicated statement or expression that it is used to prove. As you will see in this example. 5 to the n power minus 1 statement is divisible by 4 for all the numbers 1, 2, 3, 4, and so on. To start with mathematical induction, the first step is known as the basis step. This is when you take 1 and you input it algebraically into the given expression, and you verify the give it the first statement the uh, indicated statement that is true in this case 5 minus 1 is equal to 4 uh, in the basis step you want to use algebraic properties to verify the initial statement the next step is known as the inductive step the inductive step is where you take n plus 1 and you input it into the same statement similar to as to as you did to in the basis step, and then again you have to use and apply algebraic properties right here if we know, remember the rules of exponents, 5 to the n plus 1 is the same thing as multiplying a 5 to the first power times 5n, and again if we focus on the 5 times 5 to the n power, which and use again algebraic properties, we can know that 5 times 5n, five we can break as 5n's, five, five that is 5n five plus 5n plus 5n five plus 5n plus 5n plus 5n five plus five is the same thing as 5 times 5n. Five and so usually in the inductive step, there's some kind of algebraic trick, or some math skill that has to be applied and this is the trick in this problem. Once you get this particular problem, then you can rewrite four of these five n's as four times five n, then you bring down the plus five n minus one. And so that with this special trick, you will be able to prove that um, the inductive step will verify since four times five n, and any number multiplied times four is certainly divisible by four, therefore, uh, this left hand side of the purple highlight is verified and 5n minus 1 as we proved earlier by assumption is divisible by 4 so therefore you make a connection with the basis step and the inductive step and that's one of the goals in induction to show that the basis step and the inductive step have been verified quod erat demonstratum